Hello everyone, welcome back to the Info City. I hope you all are doing well. Well, um, have you ever tried to download the free trial version of WinZip? And you are enjoying the software quite a lot, but all of a sudden the trial version has expired. And then you forgot about the uh, software. Then all of a sudden one day the pop-up opens uh, in your computer and it keeps on opening repetitive after every few days and you're just trying to figure out that what the problem is and why you cannot uh, I mean you are not using the software then why the pop-up keeps up opening and uh, you try to uninstall the software from the system if the pop-up keeps up opening it says your WinZip trial has expired we hope you enjoyed your free trial version blah 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 and stuff like that and you're just worried that why the pop-up keeps up opening even though I do, you do not even have the software installed in your system. So this is something that I'm suffering from right now and I thought eh, that I'm just going to get rid of these pop, this pop-up. So I thought maybe I should also make a tutorial for you so in case if you do something like uh, similar, you can also uh, get rid of this pop-up. So the thing is that since I have already uninstalled the software from my system, but I'm still keeping, uh, still keep on, uh, the pop-up keep, keeps up showing on my system. Why is that? Why I'm, it's happening? It's because the software is gone, but its registry is still there in my Windows registry, and it's not deleted uh, from there. We have to manually uh, delete the uh, WinZip string from the registry. So how we are going to do that? We are going to try it right now. First of all, you have to open the uh, Windows registry. So what you have to do, the shortcut key is Windows plus R. When you click the Windows key with the uh, R button, uh, then you have to enter regedit, I means registry edit. And once you go there, uh, the registry will open. Just give me a sec. System is kind of slow right now. Okay, now it's asking me, do you want to allow this app to make changes? Yes. Now the registry is open. What we have to do, we have to go to the H key local machine. Here you have to go to the software. In software, you have to go to the Microsoft. Here it is. And in Microsoft, you have to go to the Windows. Windows, here is Windows, and in Windows you have to go to current version, then in current version you have to go to run, where is run, here, so in the run uh, you will see there are with the string, uh, you will see the uh, WinZip string over here. Even though you don't have it, you see it's over here. It shows C program file WinZip update notifier exe. So it keeps up showing in your system over and over and again just because the registry is not deleted. And your system keeps up reminding you that you have to update this software. So you can see all the kind of... Uh, versions that you have in your system that are going giving you notifications so what we're going to do we are going to delete this uh, zip registry yes also this one because I do not have the software in my system anymore so I can delete it so once you delete it then you will not see any of these kind of pop-ups again in your system and you have just got rid of them once and for all I hope uh, it will be uh, like you would be in a, could understand the procedure like how you can get rid of the pop-ups from your system if you have any of these kind of issues in the future. It's not just for WinZip in case if you have installed any other app like uh, sometimes it happens in Norton or Mac, Mac Free or softwares like that that you installed in your system and but in the end you end up uh, deleting the software but the notifications are still popping up then this is the reason they are popping up you have to delete it from the Windows registry. So thanks so much for watching. Have a very lovely day. I'll see you soon. Bye.